of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God. Gerskowski, Isabel Lamar, Lily Heffernan with the morning announcements. Today is Wednesday, March 10th, 2021. Quote about the day is, the best angle from which to approach any problem is the, to try the angle. Today, Anonymous wrote that. Today is National Day, National Woman, Girls, HIV, AIDS Awareness Day. Observed annually on March 10th, National Woman and Girls HIV AIDS Awareness Day improves people every with knowledge and information re regarding HIV AIDS. I focus, they focus on often overlooked impact is on women and girls. Lunch today is hot dog. Weather today is a high of 48 and a low of 23. It will snow this weekend, so stay warm. We have one more day until spring break, so I hope you have an awesome break. Recess and teaching today is three. Today's enrichment is K.A. Everyone have an awesome day. And remember, bulls lead the way. Good morning, Bennett Ranch Bulls, and it is a good morning. We have two days left before spring break. Two days. Whew. Now I'm gonna be honest. I'm not trying to be neg negative. I'm not trying to be grouchy. But I do want to recognize something because it is true. This year is hard. Some of us are struggling. Some of our students are struggling with their behaviors. There are too many stories right now where we have students who have not been their best Bennett Ranch Bull. But here's the good news. Most of our students, a large, large number of kids, have been absolutely amazing. When it's hard or when there's a challenge, they try to be even better. I gotta tell you, each day, we have kindergarten kids who have great hearts and help their friends. We have third grade students who admit they made a mistake and they ask a friend to forgive them. We have fifth graders who realize they are role models and they need to show all the other students throughout the school how to act. And they try to be the best version of themselves to let all the younger students know what it looks like to work hard and be your best. Each day, our school has kids that do little things to make a big difference. And that's the theme of my talk for today, how we can help each other these next two days. We're gonna do little things to make a big difference. Little things, big difference. Little things, big difference. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do is, you know what, number one, take a deep breath. A deep breath, it helps you pause your brain. And you know what, it just makes your body feel better. If you're frustrated, take a deep breath. Push pause on your brain. If you feel yourself wanting to give up, take a deep breath. Press pause, ask for help. If something is hard, take a deep breath. You know what? Your teachers, they care about you. If you take a deep breath, it can help you be ready to ask your teacher who cares about you so much for help before you jump to a decision you can't take back. So a little thing, number one, take a deep breath. All right, second, help others. You know what? You are not alone. Neither are our friends and neither are our teachers. Do you remember a time when somebody helped you? I'm gonna wait a bit, for reals. So right now, your classroom should be silent. I just want you to think. I'm gonna ask this again. Do you remember a time when somebody helped you? 
Does remembering that bring a smile to your face? When people help, it spreads happiness. Does it make you feel relieved or maybe even grateful? Like, phew, I made it through that because somebody helped me. Here's my challenge to you these next two days. Be ready to help others help someone. Help others change his lives. Finally, say thank you. Thank you. Okay. We're all working so hard right now. Some things are getting back to normal, but man, some things still feel strange. Either way, a lot of us are a little bit, or a lot of bit, tired at the end of the day. We're all working so hard. Show somebody that you appreciate them by saying thank you. Mrs. Levi gave me this giant whiteboard to write on for you guys. It's huge. You know what I told her? I said, thank you. I did not do this. When you go to thank somebody, don't just say, mm, thanks. And you just kind of walk away or you're partly walking away and looking up. Here's what you need to do. You stop your whole body. You really look at the person and you mean it. Thank you. Watch this, okay? To all the students at Bennett Ranch who give their best, thank you. To all the teachers at Bennett Ranch who work to make this a great place for kids, thank you. These two words make the world a better place. All right, little things, big difference. Little things, big difference. We can do this. I just shared three ideas, ideas with you, taking a deep breath, helping others, saying thank you. Okay. But maybe you have more ideas on how you can make our school a great place these next two days. Let's have a great couple of days before spring break. Bennett Ranch Bulls, we can do this. <laughs>